Hello friends, welcome to Supreme Education. We are going to learn one theorem about similarity and right angled triangle. Statement of this theorem is, in a right angled triangle, if the altitude is drawn to the hypotenuse, then the two triangles formed are similar to the original triangle and similar to each other. Now the first step to prove any theorem is obviously to draw a proper diagram. Now here we have to draw one right angled triangle and altitude to the hypotenuse. Here is our diagram according to the given statement. Here is one triangle ABC which is right angled at point B means triangle ABC is a right angled triangle and segment BD is perpendicular to AC means altitude is drawn to the hypotenuse. Here given will be in triangle ABC in triangle ABC angle ABC equal to 90 degree angle ABC equal to 90 degree segment BD is perpendicular to segment AC segment BD is perpendicular to segment AC and A dash D dash C A dash D dash C now next step is to write to prove for that we have to go through the statement again the part of the statement which comes after then is called to prove it means we have to prove the two triangles formed are similar to the original triangle and similar to each other now which are these two triangles the two triangles formed because of the altitude now see here in triangle abc bd is the altitude because of segment BD, the whole triangle that is triangle ABC is divided in two parts or two triangles that is triangle ADB and triangle BDC. These are the two triangles and we have to prove these two triangles similar to the original triangle means similar to triangle ABC and similar to each other means we have to prove triangle ADB is similar to triangle BDC is similar to triangle ABC means these three triangles that is these two small triangles and a bigger triangle are similar to each other this is have to prove means to prove is triangle ADB is similar to triangle ABC triangle BDC is similar to triangle ABC and triangle ADB is similar to triangle BDC. Now we'll move towards proof. We'll take first pair of triangles that is triangle ADB and triangle ABC. Triangle ADB which is green color triangle and triangle ABC that is whole triangle ABC. Now in triangle ADB and triangle ABC Angle DAB is congruent to angle BAC. Angle DAB is this angle is congruent to angle BAC. Again, this angle, same angle is common for both triangles, but the names are different. For this green color or triangle ADB, the name of this angle is angle DAB, and for whole triangle ABC, the name of this angle is angle BAC names are given according to the correspondence between vertices therefore angle DAB is congruent to angle BAC reason will be common angle now look at this angle that is angle ADB which is 90 degree and for triangle ABC angle ABC is also 90 degree hence angle ADB ADB is congruent to angle ABC ABC reason is each 90 degree is two pairs of angles or corresponding angles we got as congruent is by AA test triangle ADB is similar to triangle ABC statement number one means we have proved first pair of triangles as similar 
Now move towards second pair of triangles that is triangle BDC and triangle ABC. Now in triangle BDC and triangle ABC, check these two triangles here. That is triangle BDC, which is pink color triangle, and triangle ABC again, which is whole triangle ABC. Now in these two triangles, that is triangle BDC and triangle ABC, look at this angle, that is angle C, which is common to both triangles, but the names are different. For triangle BDC, the name of this angle is angle BCD. Angle B, B, C, D. And for whole triangle ABC, the name of this angle is angle ACB. Therefore, angle BCD is congruent to angle ACB. Reason is common angle. Also, angle BDC is 90 degree and angle ABC is 90 degree. Hence, angle BDC is congruent to angle ABC. Reason is each 90 degree. Hence, triangle BDC is similar to triangle ABC by AA test. That is statement number 2. Now look at statement number 1 and statement number 2. In statement number 1, we got triangle ADB is similar to triangle ABC. And in statement number 2, we got triangle ABC is similar to triangle BDC. This first triangle is similar to second. Second triangle is similar to third. Listen again. First triangle that is ADB is similar to ABC. Second triangle that is ABC is similar to third that is triangle BDC. Is first and third triangles are similar to each other by using transitivity property. Hence, from 1 and 2, and by using transitivity property, we can write triangle ADB is similar to triangle BDC. Triangle ADB is similar to triangle BDC. That is statement number 3. Hence, from 1, 2, and 3, these three triangles are similar to each other that is triangle ADB is similar to BDC is similar to ABC. In this way we have proved the two triangles are similar to each other and similar to the original triangle means we have reached up to our target. Thank you.